Looks like we have a familiar face joining us at the desk, Jackie. That's right. You uh, probably saw him on our stage or our set last time talking about the Arctic Stick. Yes. Uh, up and coming entrepreneur, and you're talking about a convention as well. Brandon yeah. Adams joining us. Good to see you, my friend. Thank you, guys. Okay, shake hands. There you go. It's sure good to be back. Hi. Yeah. <laughs> how, first of all, how's the stick going? It's good. You can get it on Amazon. Actually, getting ready for the big Black Friday sale. Oh, so, you know that. Right. Awesome I know, right? So you can get a good deal on there. But I, I was here, what was it, a year ago? I actually, had, yeah. I moved here to start a company, did Arctic Stick, did a crowdfunding campaign, raised a lot of money, even got on USA Today for it. How about that? It, it was awesome. It was during Shark Tank casting call. That was a big hype. Everybody knows about Shark Tank, right. obviously. So did that, and from there, after doing a campaign, I realized how hard it was. People don't just give you money in crowdfunding. So like any entrepreneur, I saw a problem. Most people were failing, so I wanted to help others with crowdfunding. I studied the market, I traveled the country, interviewed the best, I even interviewed the guys that made the coolest cooler. They raised about 13.2 million. I Remember those started. guys? Yeah. Yeah. Right. This is one with the blender on it. And oh, all. it has, it has everything. everything. Yeah. 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 Mm -hmm. Right. And, and being an ice guy, I grew up in an ice business. I'm like, that's a perfect product. Right. He did awesome. Raised a lot of money. Interviewed the guys for that, and then I just interviewed other people, and I studied the market, and I wrote a book on it. Hey, what do you know? When you're an expert, you got to write a book. You gotta write a book. So I wrote the book. He's in the crowd. You can find it on Amazon as well. But I found out what it takes to succeed, and I made a fund formula for crowdfunding success. Simple. Fund. F for forethought. You need to prepare a campaign 45 to 60 days ahead of time. Put up a website, landing page, direct people to it, build up your email list, but also put the content together. You don't realize you got to put at least 100, 200 hours in your campaign before you launch. Some people throw it up there think it's going to succeed. It doesn't happen. You, for the utilized marketing plan, you got to promote to the max. Beyond social media, people think, oh, I'm going to tweet it out, I'm going to share it, right. everybody's going to like it, and we're going to have right. overnight sensation. You have to actually boost your ads, and then also get ambassadors on board, get big influencers to spread the word about your campaign. Such as? Uh, a good one. I could be an ambassador, <laughs> influencer. You could get Seth Godin on board, Lewis Howes, any big name. Maybe Ashton Kutcher. He would be a great one. Mm -hmm. He's People an Iowa guy. He's oh, an Iowa good. guy, mm -hmm. and he, he would be willing to help because he loves supporting Iowa. But also try to get in the local newspaper. We actually just got in the newspaper here two days ago mm -hmm. about what we're doing, and then also try to get on TV like I'm doing here. Mm -hmm. That helps spread the word. What's the difference between uh, Indiegogo, GoFundMe, and Kickstarter as far as raising funds? So Indiegogo allows you to raise money for about anything. You can raise for nonprofits, whatever it is, and they actually allow you to do flexible funding. Kickstarter, it's all or none. If you set your goal for 10000 you have, let's say, 30 days to do it, you have to reach that goal, otherwise you don't get the money. And then what happens? The money goes back to the whoever So let's it. say you raise 8000 of the 10000 and the, the timer goes out and you're out of time. The people don't get charged and you don't get your money. Got it. GoFundMe is more for somebody paying for any kind of bills, if they got medical bills, okay. anything like that. They're all great platforms. I, I like Kickstarter. Indiegogo is good as well, but they're all great platforms. It just depends on what you're using it for. Now, you were talking about promotion, and I think what, what some people don't realize when, you, when, you, when you're looking at especially Facebook, you think, okay, if I put this out here, yeah. everybody who follows me is going to see it, and right. that's, that's not at all no, true. No, it's not it? the case. I mean, you got to be more interactive. If it goes to the next part, if we go to the end of narrative, you got to have a great video. So on Facebook, obviously, people love watching the videos. You got to put a great video together for your campaign. Have it Hollywood material. We had Situation Films put ours together, and they did awesome. Six days it took to film it. And I was and how long of a film are we talking here? We're talking a three minute and 38 second film, six days of work, and that film has about 20% of what you see. Okay. Great video. People love watching that. It gets their attention. They're more likely to pledge. And it can't be too long, right? Because people just aren't going to watch. People, I mean, in today's day and age, everything goes so fast. Mm -hmm. So we'll go to the last one, D, deliver value. you got to give a lot of great value in your awards. Discounted price level. You need to give them maybe a customized swag or hangout celebrities. You name it. Be creative. Give them something awesome. So that's the fun formula I've used and I've helped others use. And the campaign we're doing now for the Young Entrepreneur Convention is what we've been using. And I mean, we've had a lot of success already. We're, I think we had 10 days left. We've raised close to $15,000. We have people coming to this event from 15 different states, two different countries, a lot of attention with it. It's awesome, it's exciting to see it. We have a great team, all entrepreneurs in Des Moines. We have people that have started their own businesses and seen what it's like. And our, our whole vision with this event is we wanna put Des Moines, Iowa on the map. 
moved here a year and a half ago, I saw how supportive they are here. I mean, you got so many people that help entrepreneurs. And people sometimes look at Iowa, they're like, oh, a bunch of people in cornfields. Are these the speakers that are going to be a part of the they, That's convention? part of our team right there. Okay. So we have, that's part of our team right there. Great group of people. We have people from Iowa State University, interns. We, and then we're some of our speakers right there. John Lee Dumas of Entrepreneur on Fire. He's oh, Kenny Shamrock. Ken Shamrock, yeah. the world's most dangerous him, yeah. man. Yeah. He's, <laughs> he's going to be there at the event. And I'll be speaking, Des Woodruff. And we have some other big names we can't announce yet, but it's, it's so exciting to see the amount of people we have there. So beyond the speakers, you can pitch your, your actual idea. So we're going to cap it out 150 businesses. You can pitch to us, have a chance to win prizes. We actually have Zarly Law Firm that sponsored the event. Big sponsor, thank you to them. And they're going to allow us to have great prizes for people to win. And the top 10 people for the pitch competition are going to pitch in front of us, and then we have some celebrities lined up to judge. And that's perfect. So if that people works. want more information, they want to get involved, where's the best place to go well, to find out you more? Well, you can go to youngentrepreneurconvention.com, check out all the information there. If you want to become a speaker, be a part of everything, contact us, or go to Indiegogo, search Young Entrepreneur Convention, pledge your campaign, you can get a ticket for 29 bucks. I mean, that's a no-brainer. Sponsor us. It, it's a great opportunity, and what we're trying to do here is create a movement seen across the country to put Iowa on the map and to support entrepreneurs across the country I and in this, Iowa. I think this is going to work. That it, it's going to work. It's going to work. It's going to work. <laughs> and you guys should come. We might have hey, to. Hey, you'll have to be there. It'll be a lot of fun. Why would I want to le leave the fabulous world of broadcast? <laughs> <laughs> so you, can, you, you can become an entrepreneur. <laughs> all right, all, like I said, all you need is one really good idea. That's hey, right. I would and love to see you by. pitch. Uh, you could pitch to us. I have some ideas. <laughs> <laughs> There you go. And if people want more information, they can also check out your book. Yeah, check out the book. You can go to BrandonTAdams.com. You can find this on Amazon. Perfect. Great book. If you want to use it for crowdfunding, I'm here to help you. There okay. it is. Thank you, sir.